What's going on guys, my name is Joe, and welcome to today's video. I haven't posted in about five fucking days, but it's alright. I've been busy with school since school started. I'm gonna have a video about that coming up soon, shortly. A quick commentary with some COD gameplay. Anyway, besides that, it's he Minecraft here. I promised you guys this two days after the last upload, but like I said, school. I'm busy with other shit, trying to find a job and all that. It's so sad. It honestly is. School and trying to find a job. I'm gonna have no time to play video games. Anyway, um... Besides that, all that sadness, I'm actually going to be showing you guys, like I said, a cool way to uh, build another portal. And did I hear something? A skeleton? Yep, I did. Alright, so we're actually going to... Actually, let's do this. Okay. Hold on. There we go. Burn it up a little bit, you know? Perfect. And let me get into the water before I die. Perfect. Alright. So, uh, I also reached level 32 just by mining a little bit over here. So you guys can see a, lot of, a bunch of coal from that Fortune 2 pickaxe. I can't believe we got that. Uh, so, anyway, let me show you guys real fast how to make a quick nether portal if you do not have any diamonds to mine the obsidian with. So, I'm here downstairs. Or, downstairs. I'm here in the uh, mine shaft that I made. You guys can see right over here. So, obviously, you need obsidian to make the nether portal. That's number one. The nether portal is four. It's, uh... 4x5, I believe. Yes, it's 4x5 creation. So you need 4 in the bottom, and you need, uh, and you go up by 5. And the hollow, the 6 mil points in the middle are hollow. So to do this really easily, since I already have this down over here, what you could do is go like this with the lava. I'm going to try and do this really quickly because I don't want the uh, water to overlap it. And it already did. Okay, it's fine. And then you do the same thing for this side over here. And then you keep on doing this for another time. As you guys can see, I'm pretty sure you guys understand what I'm doing at this point. Which is in case, I have a lot of lava here. And I'm pretty sure there's a zombie coming up too. I hear it moving. I hear it moving. Alright, so add this one over here. Keep on adding blocks as well. One there, one there, one there. Like that. Just like that, here, there. Up, oh, accidentally fell down. Then we need to do it two more times. Well, actually, well, let's see how tall this is. Yeah, we need to do it two more times. On one more side. One more time on each side. So let's do that. Just like up. Oh, I'm going to need to raise the roof. There we go. Nice little, little nether portal right over here. Do I have some? Do I have? Do I even have some? Uh... All right, let me go get a flint steel real fast. All right, guys, so I got my flint steel. I'm ready to light this bitch. Let's do it. And there you go. Boom. That's how you make another portal. Now we aren't gonna go in. I'm gonna save that for next episode because I actually want to do some other stuff, uh, such as working onto the house and actually showing you guys uh, the rest of the farm. Now, real fast too. I am level 30. Let me take care of this guy. Now I do not have any more diamonds, so we're I'm gonna need to mine some more. Now hopefully I'm hoping that we get at least two out of one block over here. No we did not. Oh we got that's fucking great. We got three out of that one. That's great. Alright. So that's all we need for now. Now I'm hoping that I get another fortune pickaxe or something like that so that we could add these two together. Make it fortune three. So we'll be doing that. And I also finished up I'm pretty sure I said this, I'm not sure if I did it already though, but anyway. I finished up the rest of the uh automatic wheat farm and carrot farm slash potato farm. So I put nice glass around it, you guys as you guys are gonna see here in a second, and fucking cows are moving. Great. Alright. Let's just run past them. I also, a little bit over here too, I also expanded a little bit of this. I turned most of the sand into dirt around the uh, edges of the lake. But here is the automatic wheat farm, slash potato farm, slash carrot farm. Now, I'm going to sleep real fast though. Turn it, to, turn it into daytime, so that way I don't need to deal with any monsters or creepers blowing me up. 
Come on. Wake up. There we go. Perfect. All right, let's go. So I decided to do a white stained glass for the side and do just regular glass for the top to make it look like a uh, green greenhouse room or uh, something like that, like a glass room. All right, that's taken care of. So it, me personally, I think it looks really nice with the white stained glass, and I want like I want to make it seem like the sun's going through really nice and clearly. So with the white stained glass didn't look that clear but with just regular glass it did so I thought it was a nice touch and the white stained glass on the side really does fit it all uh, along with the cobblestone border so let's actually since I'm uh, I'm decent with food let's just go through this real fast and I'll go show you guys my house I'm not sure if you guys noticed this but I actually pushed back the house uh, about three blocks it was it was exactly three blocks I pushed it back now you guys are wondering also, I probably have this one painting over here. Now my idea, like I said in the last video, was to make it seem like this was just like a small house. But then in retrospect, it's actually a lot bigger and you'd be able to see like glass on top of there. And I was thinking about making like an elevator. So I'm actually going to go into creative probably uh, tomorrow and, think of, and try and make an elevator, redstone, uh, sticky piston elevator. So. I spaced out this a little bit, I got rid of the enchantment table. So what I'm having an idea of doing is making this like all red carpet or something like that, make decorating the walls with torches. And probably I'll probably change it to stone brick, maybe. Or quartz. And then I'll have an elevator going up about uh twenty blocks or so, thirty. Up to around if you guys see where my cursor's at, up to around like there maybe. So that'll be that for that house. We'll be working on that a little bit more. And let us collect all this. Perfect. Alright, so I'm going to replant all these things. I'm going to make the diamond pick, and I'll be right back with you guys. Alright guys, I made the enchantment table again. I, <laughs> I fucking actually, I walked in here. I was thinking that the enchantment table was already here. And then I looked at I was like, oh shit, I gotta fucking make all the bookshelves again. So, I don't want to do that because it has such little lettering. But then again, I want to do the one with, I do the one with big lettering. One with big lettering always seems like the best option to do. Does it give me the big lettering or no? Alright, there it is. Alright, I'm hoping we get fortune again. If we get fortune again, that'd be perfect. Alright, I'm not looking. Crossing my fingers. I'm tapping the X button with my finger. Alright, open my eyes. I'm moving the cursor. I have no idea what it is. Oh, you bitch. Fuck. 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 No. Ah, that's fucking. That's doo doo, man. That's that's honestly doo doo. That's not even good. That's just like having a normal pickaxe that just mines faster. And damn it, man. Ah. All right. Well, that's <laughs> that's for that, I guess. Now. Damn, I'm pissed. I'm really pissed off about that. Fuck. I just wasted I just wasted another diamond pickaxe. Oh, you know what that'll be? That'll be just my normal pickaxe then for now. And then I'll enchant again, hopefully get fortune again. If not, then I'll add on, I'll add that on to the uh, other one, make it an anvil and combine it to make it uh all used up again, have full durability. Alright. Uh how long only eighteen minutes, wow. I've not been recording that long as I used to be. Alright, since we have some more time on our hands, I actually, oh, let me go get a map. Okay, so as I was saying, I actually did explore a little bit more of the uh, of the world over here, as you guys can see. A little bit more that way. Now, I actually want to try and go find a horse, so that way we can actually, so that way I can actually, on my own, explore more of the world, hopefully find a village, and... Just find some maybe some potatoes there. I know they don't have any uh, watermelon seeds there, but it's perfectly fine. We actually take this. I don't know if I have a saddle though. I should have a saddle. Where's it at? Let's turn here. No, they are not. Where are? Do we not have any saddles? Oh wow! I. Don't even have any saddles, so I can't even do anything. Alright, well, you know what we can do? We can actually leave the horse. Let me give you four. 
four of those, and you need one. You need one slime, but we're, I don't have a slime now. Where's? Oh, here it is. I missed my my whole inventory is all messed up, guys. Just work with me. So we'll take that. We can actually make a lead. I'll bring one fence post. Perfect. And now let's do this. Should be in the tools, I'm assuming, right? I have no idea where the lead's at. Oh, here it is. Perfect. So what we can do up. Oh, all right, I'm sleeping. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna try and find a horse out in that green open area. I'm gonna leave a fence down there. Leave a fence post down there. Uh, leave the horse where it is because I can't ride it, obviously, since I don't have a uh, saddle yet. Unless I have one, I didn't even see it. Unless you guys want to tell me that. Um, and we'll just see what happens from there. So we'll let us go this way. I was honestly looking over here too, and that place actually looks like a pretty cool uh, place to build on. It's just a floating island. So I may do something with this later on. Probably have like a bridge connecting to that. That looks sick. Alright. So let us go. We could go straight this way. It's weird, I really never did any exploring in this part of the, uh, for this world that is, especially. But I don't know. I just I just like staying around the house over there that I had, mostly because I remember when I played on the Xbox 360 world that I had, I usually just stay around. It was only one map, so it wasn't even that big. I don't even think I I did explore the whole thing, but I just seemed to stay in one place at a time. All right. Now I should have. I honestly should have made some more maps so that way I could have filled out other maps. Because one of, one of the cool things you could do in this game is. If you make a bunch of maps together, like in different regions that you guys can see, like I'm not on the map anymore, it's just a dot on there, and I like the arrow. If you make a map in this area that I'm at right now, it'd make a new map, and you could fill that one out. I should have made a sword too, I don't know what I was thinking. You could fill that one out, and actually with a uh, item frame, you put the whole, you put the entire map on a uh, block, and make it into like one huge map. And what's this over here? That was nothing. I thought it was like a village path or something. Oh, that's dangerous. I'm getting away from that. What's over here? If we find, if I find a village or something like that, then I'm probably gonna end the episode. I know that these have been getting shorter, but honestly, people do like shorter episodes. I'm pretty sure. So let's just keep going this way. Yeah, I really should have brought an extra map. And I'm surprised that there's no animales here. Alright, uh, there's some sheep, cows, horses are going to be here soon, no? Bah. Oh, there's a mushroom biome right over there. You can only, you can, like, barely, you can see it if I'm not even looking at it, but if I'm looking at it, you can't see it. That's fucking dumb. Maybe over here there's some horses. Horses are usually found in, like, the plains. But sometimes I'm pretty I'm pretty sure you can find them like in the foresty areas. I right, hear a lot of cows over here. No horses though. Where the hell are the horses at? I may actually just go over to that mushroom biome, see what's uh check out what's over there. What's this? Nothing. Nothing's down there. Man, there's really no horses here. Oh, there's a desert over there. All right, let's keep going this way. I yeah, I really should have brought a map. I don't know why I did this without bringing an extra map, but it's whatever. Is that a village over there? No, it's nothing. Oh shit! Look at this small ass village. Let's go check it out. Now this would be great if there's a horse here too. Now no horses? No. All right. Look at this. They have potatoes. This, this would be awesome. This would be set. I'm going to take all their books too. Hopefully they don't get mad at me for taking their books. Where are they at? Where are they at? I'm going to make some trades with them. Oh, here's one. What's up? What's up? Alright, you're terrible. Hey, hey, hey. Priest man, what's going on? That's 
also terrible. What the fuck? Do you guys have any like wool trades or anything? There's only two of them here. Are they are they married? Oh, there's no potato. There's no potatoes here either. Oh wait, what's this guy want? This guy could be probably be good. Apples. Nope, that's not good either. Is it the same guy? I think it's the same guy. Yes, it is. Gosh darn it. Alright. Fuck. Well, I'm going to end the episode here. I'm going to try and find my way back. Uh, so, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. I'm probably going to... I'm thinking about making this village into something pretty nice. Probably put a nice cobblestone wall around it. Kind of like uh, Attack on Titan, in a way, without the Titans. But trust me, this place will look good if I had a wall around it. Too bad it's not bigger, though. And too bad we did not find the horses. Yes. That's a donkey? It's a donkey. Yes, it's a donkey. It's a donk. <laughs> yes, look at it. Look at the beauty of it. I want to take this one. This one looks cool. This one looks like it got. This one looks like it has poop on it. Oh, I forgot too. I could actually with the lead. I could actually bring it back. I don't know why. I have to be careful here. There's a ravine like right there. Oh, this thing already loves me. All right, it's cool. Perfect. Look at this. All right, follow me. Yes, yes, yes. Could I actually bring two of them back? I don't even know. Oh my gosh. Climb, man, climb. Don't fall into a ravine. Why don't you climb? You fucking horse. Great, let's see what happens over here. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. Oh my god, you fucking bitch. Well, you guys, we uh, finally got him over here. It took a while. I probably showed you guys some of the clips of me getting a little bit upset over uh, Gerard here. Or I don't even know what I want to call him. Probably gonna call him Moose to be honest. He looks like a uh He looks like, or like maybe Oreo. He looks like he's got like Oreos on top of him or something like that. Like chocolate. He looks like chocolate kinda looks like chocolate milk in a way. I don't know. I like his his feet though are like nice and white though. Look at that. I actually never saw a horse horse like this. Before we do anything, let's actually add some armor onto him as well. Perfect. Look at that. Well, I think I'm gonna end it here guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, please do a like, comment, subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you guys in the next part. Real fast though, uh, I'm thinking about uploading, my friend actually gave me Destiny, so if you guys want to, let me know if by leaving a like, a comment, thing if you guys want some Destiny, and I should be uploading Grow Home, if you guys do not know what that is, I'm, I can't wait to show you guys that game, this game is fucking beautiful. Anyway, thanks for watching, please do a like, subscribe, comment down below, and I'll see you guys in the next part. Alright, see you guys later. Peace. Bye.